Today's video is a very easy recipe um, that I came up on the fly and I've done it once with my Instant Pot and I love it. My husband loves it. If you want to see how this awesome recipe of Italian sausage and bell peppers and onions and sauerkraut is all done, keep watching. It's very easy meal to make. It's yummy and it's delicious and it's really affordable. I just planned my week and this is what we wanted for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let's begin. Here's some of my ingredients, you guys. I have some rolls and I do have onions and bell peppers, uh, green and red. You could have them fresh. I don't have them fresh. I buy them for a dollar in the freezer aisle. I usually have three or four bags at a time for a week because I make a lot of scrambled eggs with it and I cook a lot with it. It's really easy for me. Anyways, I have some vegetable oil. You could use whatever oil you want. It's Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and turn my Instant Pot on saute. So it heats up. Add a little bit of oil in there, just enough to coat the bottom of the pot. And then I'm going to just brown both sides of the sausage. Um, I have six pieces. That's more than that for me. You can guys do more than that. It's just me and my husband and my baby. And I am currently expecting baby number two. So I eat for two. Usually I would eat one roll, but I, I ate two that night. Anyways, so I'm just going to brown them up like that. It's sizzling. It's lovely. I love my Instant Pot. It's my savior. I use it at least six times a week. Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and chop up. Uh, my onions and bell peppers. You don't need to do that. You could skip this whole thing and just brown your sausage from both sides and then take it out and then just saute that with sauerkraut. I had to chop it up because I have a little tiny baby and she e could choke on things even though it would probably melt in her mouth but still. Just a rough chop. That's, that's how I do it. And I'll add it up. Uh, don't mind my weird angle and my big belly, as you can see. As I said, I am expecting baby number two. Really soon, really soon. About 10 more weeks left. <laughs> Anyways, I am putting a one clove of garlic. It's fall. We're going into winter right now, so it's very important to, you know, boost your immune system. And we like garlic in this house. Anyways, I just wanted to tell you guys, I absolutely love my knife. I will make sure to link it down below for you guys. Um, this one, I believe, either made in Thailand or Japan. I'm not sure. One of those countries. I will make sure to link it up for you. Anyways, I just put some salt and pepper with my little turkey pepper dispenser. It's not the best, uh, but it's cute for the fall. My salt dispenser i have my soul thing my dad got it um in saint petersburg it's made out of wood and it's hand painted i'll try to find it and link it down below for you guys um i already added a sauerkraut in there and some ketchup as you saw just a little bit it gives that sweetness i don't know how to say it it's really good if you don't like ketchup you don't have to put it in but it does make a difference as you could see, I put all the sausage in, and then I'm going to go ahead and turn it off of the saute. Make sure that I'm, I'm on seal, not on venting, <laughs> with my lid, and then I'm going to put it on manual for 10 minutes. And the reason why I do 10 minutes, you could do 15, but I wouldn't. Why? Um, it comes out perfect, uh, tender, and just delicious. And trust me, 10 minutes is not enough time. It flies with the little toddler that you have to chase around the house. Yeah. I had to go pick up my husband, so I had to release it myself. Usually I will allow it to um, slow release, but I had to just make sure everything looks good. And I just left it on warm. Anyways, this is how it looks. It came out really good. My husband was asking for more of it. I only had six pieces. Anyways, we ate it all. We enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will make sure to link all the tools that I have used, my Instant Pot, my knife, and whatever I could find. 
down below. If you're interested in something more, comment down below. Don't be afraid to ask me. And if you liked and enjoyed this video, please thumbs up. Don't forget. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and click on a little bell. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much, you guys. Bye.